Nigga. It's been a while since I left the island. Now I'm getting a bad feeling. Oh no! Thunder strikes! It is raining. I can't turn back. I would be on her. She would be on her. You know, I'm gonna try to remind myself to add in the Star Fox, you know, when he dies. I try to remind myself to do that, to add that in on this part. There you go, I'm gonna do that. It's fucked up, by the way. Mary. Oh, no, she's dead. But wait, I survived. It wouldn't be called survival kids if I didn't survive. And now I'm on another island. Again. You just got bad luck, girl. Alright, so it says we lost a lot of stuff. We didn't lose anything. Except for my big stick. I already got one of those, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> We're gonna eat. Cause Mary's hungry. Oh look, it's my monkey. Well, if Eddie's here, that means we're on the same island. Fine, I won't leave you behind. But you will make a good meal if I get too hungry. Never had monkey brains, but I'm it. So, that rhombus gem I got earlier is game crucial. And I left it in my other hut. But don't worry, it's not lost forever. But this is basically, uh... What you have to do now to beat the game. You got a boat, and it's locked up for some odd reason by some shake gems. I don't know who did this. Who thought this was a good idea? I don't know. But, uh... Yeah. So you're gonna collect gems now. To go home. So let's drink some delicious water, huh? Which, for some reason, is clean in here. Even though know, it should just be uh, ship water. Not ship water. Sea water. Yeah, you're getting tired. Let's go inside the boat because there ain't nowhere to get out right now. And suddenly, the wall opens. So we're going to go to sleep. Nine days. Survive nine days. Alright, let's go and explore the... wherever the hell we are on this island. We're gonna pick up this stick, because we always need a stick. We're also gonna eat everything that we see. See this berry? Eat this berry. See this fruit? Eat this fruit. We're also going to go back and get the clam that I saw on the beach, because we're going to need it. And why we're going to need it? Oh, you'll see in a few minutes. If a fox doesn't show up and try to murder me in the face. I feel like I really should get back into speedrun in this game because, I mean, I feel like I can get the world record in this. I know all the tips and tricks of the trade. I had it before, and I want it for good. And since the guy who has the fox. So, <clears throat> we're going to do what you can do in real life. When you see something you don't like, you walk away, you go back, and it's gone. I don't need that. No, I'm gonna eat you because you handle fatigue. I'm gonna get some more sticky mass from this unique tree. 
Eat this because it's on the floor. Take you. And I shouldn't have eaten you, but I ate you anyways. No, I thought I was a boss again. I'm doing these things. Alright, so, remember that clam I had? Well, alligators in this time and period are... They just don't like these. They do not like clams. They do not like raw clams, so it just murders the shit out of them. come out the water trying to kill me and then I just throw a clam in their mouth and they're like oh, oh, and they die and since nothing goes to waste in this game we're gonna use their dead body as a bridge Whee. thank you alligator don't worry we're gonna kill that alligator too I'm not gonna lie, that frog kinda scared me, but it's a frog! Murder it. And... It's a tree hut. Now the thing with tree huts, um... You kinda... You, you can't go to sleep at them at any time, but it's best to set up a campfire beforehand. Because you're gonna hear a lot of... You know, you're basically just sleeping under a tree. And so you don't... You're gonna have a restless sleep if you don't do that. So the fire will keep the, you know, the baddies at night at bay. It's ten days. Whoops. Alright. Oh, why is it raining? Crap. Anyways, so, we gotta get that sparkly in the water. How do we get the sparkly in the water? Well, we have to do some stuff like move these giant rocks so we can... Did he say I can't do it while it's raining? Oh, okay. Splash! Oh, that scared me. That scared Eddie, too. Hey, there's a rock right here. Let's move for no reason. We'll see what happens. Oh, no! Oh, Eddie! I like how he just drifted perfectly where I need him to go, too. And there he is. So we do, we cross this lily pad to pick up another lily pad. Or a, a lotus leaf. this lotus leaf to move this rock which I would like to point out that we are no longer afraid of well it didn't go splash but we need this lotus leaf so we can make another bridge so I can get to that yeah I almost fell in the water Sorry, if you see my mouse on the screen, uh, forgive me. Uh, yeah, just forgive me. It's the accident. And me trying to not being fully prepared before I start recording and stuff, so. Anyways, so now that we got, uh, that square gem, and we also got that, uh, that piece of rock, that piece of rock, We are going to I don't need that. I'm gonna eat you. You're delicious and full of some type of nutrients that I don't know of. We're gonna get this or not. We're gonna get this stick and 
And because it's raining, we can't cross over like we normally would because it floods, which is sucks. So we gotta go all the way back around. You're getting tired. I don't care what the hell you're getting. But we're gonna go home, so don't worry. Actually, I forget. Now, if we have another alligator, we gotta murder. Actually, instead of murdering it, we're gonna paralyze it for life. It'll never move again. I also really love the music in this game. Yeah, drowsy, whatever. You're just gonna have to deal, girl. But yeah, I, I love the music in this game. I just love this whole game overall. And it's not because I can speed run it in a good rate. Like, when I was little, one of my neighbors let me borrow this game because he had it on the Game Boy Color. Um, and I played it, and I had no idea what I was doing. I couldn't even... I couldn't play the game for more than five minutes because I would just starve to death or be killed. Like I had no idea what I'd need. I don't need you. Oh, we're gonna stop it from moving. Don't worry. Paralyzed. Forever. So... Yeah, you're feeling drowsy, whatever. We're gonna eat this stick boot. And we're gonna come over here and see what this is. Something's written here, but it's too dirty to read. But lucky for you, I can't just use the water that's right next to it. I have to use water from my canteen. Hey, there's a sign over here. Something tells me I should go to where that was. Because there is a map in the game. But it's, it's pretty useless. Chop. Alright, and now I can go back home. And to home I go. But before I go to sleep, I am going to mash these two together with your sleep. No, I hate when I do that. I didn't. It's basically the quick save of the game, but it just gets in the way. Yeah, yeah, we know. What gym do I have? I have the square gym. So we are going to put it in the square slot. I know I should have just put it in the slot, but I would want to mash these two together first. Not now I put it in the slot. Two down, five to go. Yeah, I have a count. So. Is there anything I don't need? Nope, oh, I need it all. We shall sleep for tonight. We need to find the rest of those gems. Let's go, Eddie. Okay. Monkey noise. Alright, let's fill up the canteen. Let's drink some more of that delicious water. And let's go back on this island. I'm gonna need you, Stick. Fruit, but I don't feel like it. And we're gonna go through this path we made to be flung out. We don't need the bat. To 
make it back over here. Alright, so now we're back to the old hut, which is still destroyed. You would think someone will come and fix this. But, now that we're here, we can take this, and this, and do this, to make a arrow. If I had a bow. You do have a bow. Oops. So, we're gonna take the bow. And then we're gonna take my gym. And the radio is useless, and... Ta-da! 